in this lecture we are going to check a code block for c program every c program has this hash include in the angular bracket header files so what this header files are all header files contain predefined functions which we can directly use we can also call them as dependency files which can be used by your actual c program we can include one or more header files all c programs start with a fixed function name called as main this is our main function every function in c returns a value in this case i am returning a value as int we are going to check this in detail in next lectures so the starting curly braces and ending curly braces indicate the point from where my main function starts and where it ends so all the lines which are between this parenthesis are my block of main function now let us check this in more detail so these are my include header files i can have multiple include statements then my main function starts from here now inside of my main code block what i can have is declaration statements decision control statements loops call to other functions special keywords and my written data type all these points we are going to check one by one in the next lectures before that just want to make a point that how exactly a program is executed now when we say execution it doesn't mean actual execution but when we talk about the compiler the compiler compiles your code line by line and when it gets converted into machine code that machine code is also executed line by line so when i say a line it's basically an instruction that we are providing to the computer so computer executes your code block instruction by instruction that is why it is necessary to understand how exactly we can instruct the computer in step wise manner so that we can achieve our desired output if you have enjoyed this lesson give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends subscribe to our channel for more videos like this also don't forget to visit our website codegod.com for more detailed content